Shiba. I'm Aura. And today we're going to have do a fun experiment. Can you guess what it is? It's an experiment with viscosity. That word may sound complicated and tough, but this experiment is going to be lots of fun. We really had lots of fun doing it. And now, it's time to do the experiment. So for this experiment, you need some light corn syrup, dark corn syrup, some oil, we used canola oil, and some honey. You also need some water. And cups, of course, to pour them in. So we also need some marbles. Just gonna and we checked in our kitchen cabinet and we found these liquids. You can do any liquids that you have available in your kitchen cabinet. Yeah, or you can just do any liquid you have available in your house. Um, we're just using five liquids, um, light corn syrup, dark corn syrup, honey, and canola oil, and water, of course. So first we're just going to pour the corn syrups in. We have two corn syrups, light one and dark one. Just now we're just going to pour this veg or vegetable oil in, start and, gripping in it. And this is frosting. She's a white marble. And she wants to do the water. These, this is water, light corn syrup, canola oil, honey, and dark corn syrup. We're this using marbles. Marble. We're going to drop them in all the liquids that we have right now. And we're going to see which one reaches the bottom the fastest. Ready? Set, go! These ones went first. Blue went a bit slow in the water. This is not water. I mean, yeah, not in the water. We arranged it in order, so then it'll be easier. Water first. Water. Second is vegetable oil. Third yeah. is light corn syrup next is dark corn syrup and last but uh, not least is honey. honey viscosity is a physical property of fluids the word vicious comes from the latin word viscum meaning sticky it describes how fluids show resistance to flow or how thick or thin they are viscosity is affected by what the fluid is made out of and the temperature of it Viscosity is the resistance of a fluid, liquid, or gas to change in temperature and to, to change in shape. For example, water has a low viscosity as it is thin and the marble reaches the bottom first. Honey has a high viscosity and marble we put in honey reaches the bottom last. Faster because it has less viscosity. The vegetable oil had a bit more viscosity but it still went pretty quick. Uh, the light corn syrup had even more viscosity, that's why it took more time. The dark corn syrup had more viscosity than the light corn syrup, and that's why it took about 20 seconds. And the honey had the most viscosity of, of them all, that's why it took like 30 seconds. We're trying to layer this different viscosity with liquid in a glass. Honey's at the bottom. Um, then on top of that is the light corn syrup. Then next is the black corn syrup and oils at the top. Now we're going to put some in. That is dark corn syrup. That Now we have some vegetable oil. And now we have some light corn syrup. Now we're going to pour some honey, honey into it. Now we're going to race them. Let's see who wins. Right, I bet the water will win. There's or no water in I this bet one. The vegetable oil will win, see? Even I betted that. Do you see how fastly it's going? Uh-huh. There's no water in this one because the water is going to go really fast. Yeah, I knew the vegetable oil would win from the start. 
Yeah, but what you about can see the, the dark dark cord syrup and the right cord syrup are competing for a second. The dark is um going a bit fast, but the light cord syrup is going even faster than the dark one. You can also see the honey didn't move at all, so. It, hun the honey's kind of like a snail, because you know snails move slow. Yeah. And, oh, it crossed the Come finish line. You can look around and find different fluids in the kitchen and do this experiment. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and leave a comment and subscribe.